What's up guys, it's Eric Ball here, welcome back to some more Country Balls Europe 1890. So, uh, Glitch is still active, I still have all of my unlocked countries for some reason. Glitch, it's a glitch. Uh, if you didn't know, it's a glitch where I got all the countries unlocked without actually legitimately unlocking them. So, let's see what today's country is. Let's wait for it to pop up on the right side. That looks like Luxembourg. Is that a light blue? I can't tell from this thing. Can I? Can I pull this back? Nope. Okay. Anyway, that looks like Luxembourg. I don't know. I can't tell which type of which blue it is. But anyway, today we're gonna be playing 1922 campaign as the Weimar Republic right here. Legendary. Um. So. Um, you might notice that this video is a little bit louder than our past videos, and I have a perfect reason for that. It's because that I have two fans now. So remember during the Ottoman Empire playthrough, I had only one fan, which allowed me to film a much longer video without my computer overheating? Well, this is the same, except now I have two fans, which is quite nice. Um, one of them is just perpetually set to two, um, and then the other one is the old one I have here, it, I, three for battles, two for, uh, regular playthrough, and on my left I have a brand new tower, or stand, no, it's a tower fan, and then it's set to two right now, and I'll bump it up to four when we are in a battle, so, we're gonna start by attacking Belgium, uh, not, not Belgium, the Netherlands, because I need some puppets, and I think the Netherlands would be a perfect first puppet. So I should probably be doing some training before I do that, because I, I don't want to I don't wanna go in there with like no health and die, so let's do a bit of defense training. I'm probably going to fail miserably each time, but it's always good to try, right? Especially when it involves spending your money. Like that's that kind of that kind of trying that kind of failing is just the greatest. Um, this is actually really interesting because the official title for the Weimar Republic, or I have I've heard people call it the Weimar Republic. Uh, I've heard people say call it the Weimar Republic. Different names for different people. Some people like to call it Weimar. Some people like to call it Weimar. I believe Weimar is a little more accurate because that's in German, but I'm not. I'm actually not very sure. But actually, the official title, the official English title for the Weim for the Weimar Weimar Republic is um, the German Reich. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. I, that might have just been a terrible mistake. But yeah, the German Reich. Um, surprisingly though, um, Hilter, who came into power later as uh, the guy from the bad no-no Germans, the, 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 the ones that start with N, the name starts with N, you know, the bad Germans that came after the Weimar Republic. Uh-oh. Anyway, those guys ended up calling the Holy Roman Empire the First Reich, and they said that the uh, the Second Reich was the German Empire, and the Third Reich was the Thousand Years Reich, which was obviously their Reich. Anyway, now I'm gonna attack the Netherlands. And actually, these two fans are working perfectly. My my thing, my computer has not even overheated in the slightest yet. So, as the German Empire, you start out with pistols and sandbags. I don't know when we're going to see those sandbags come in. But, yeah, you start with those. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Um, yep, there they are, sandbags. Well, we don't really need that. Right? Because they're just going to keep sleeping. Dang it. Come on. Come on. Four. Down to four. Twenty-one. Boom. Two. Yes. Boom. Oh. When is it gonna, when are, please. Oh my god. I, I, I don't, I, just give me, give me some extra attack. Sleep. Of course, of course they, they of course they would do that. Uh oh, that's not good, um, uh, boom, alright. That almost went terribly, but now we have a new puppet state. That's very nice. I got to go into the tavern and buy a couple of potions to heal myself after that terrible confrontation. That almost went terribly. But anyway, the original name was the German Reich, and the 
Weimar Republic. I'm just gonna call it the Weimar Republic because that name sounds cooler. But the Weimar Republic was actually um, the official title was the German Reich. I think I already mentioned that, but most people just called it Germany, and their flag was actually the one of modern day Germany. So that means that that little extra little thing there is just to kind of distinguish the game for the game. You know, the game just shows you. All right, this is this is Weimar. This is not. Uh, this is not the. This is not the modern day Germany. So yeah. All right, new puppets. This is actually going really well so far. We need as many puppets as possible. France is the good one. Belgium, Great Britain is the good one. France. Ah. Uh, Oh, France is about to take him out. We gotta, we gotta. This is this. <sighs> I don't wanna. Wait, I, I need to invade France for Paris anyway. Um, alright, we're gonna declare war on, on France. Yeah, that's that. I have my puppets. I have my puppets. So I think we're gonna be good for a little march for Paris. But the problem is, we are currently probably weaker. Yeah, weaker than France. So that's a problem. Um, I'm gonna actually go ahead and take this province here right next to Paris. Nope, nope. Get my get my puppets in here. Um, we're gonna be fighting for a while, so I'm gonna turn both of these fans up. So you basically at this point just can't even hear me anymore. As you can hear, though, the stand, the tower fan on the left is actually beeping. That's cool. But anyway, uh, the, the right one's the one that's really doing all the work, but it is farther away from the computer, because it's bigger, so, yeah. Kind of unfortunate, but anyway, this thing's just gonna help out here. Oh, oh, Belgium, let's go! Alright, Poland is starting to stack soldiers on my border. I'm gonna turn this down, this is the main thing causing all of the uh, sound. Um, my computer is starting to heat up, so that's not good. Um, anyway, though, so, what do the French have over me that makes my less power? First of all, their health, and then their, so, they're gonna increase the, my attack to be one slot higher than them, and I'm just gonna increase my health. Alright, perfect. And then now we just tavern, drink a little bit of potion here, and we're just gonna exit. I could have done the mini game, but if you remember what happened the last time I tried the mini game on my British Conquest Classic, that didn't go so well. It took me a little bit, three minutes. But anyway, Paris is going to be ours soon. And they and they've left one guy to defend Paris. All right, that this is this just gets better and better. Uh, in English, it's Weimar, Weimar, but like uh, for some reason people call it Weimar. I don't know. Uh, we're just gonna peace offering. Yep. All right. So we've taken already one of the cities. Actually, we have two because Berlin's also one of the cities you need. Uh, so next up, we're gonna go after Vienna, Austria. But first, we need another puppet. So we're gonna offer an alliance to the Soviet Union, I believe. Soviet Union offer uh, alliance. They're gonna want to do that. Okay, because I need I need Persia. That's that's something I need. France and Luxembourg are allies. France as is probably trying to start a counterattack. Anyway, declare war on Persia. Now everyone's gonna declare war on Persia. See if I can make this a little easier. Nope. All right, into Persia we go. Obviously, the Soviet Union is not really going to help out. I, ju I just kind of allied with the Soviet Union to get a border with uh, Persia, so I, so I could actually attack them. Ah, uh, uh, is Pro? I don't, I don't think. Oh, yep, there we go. All right, Persia is now our puppet. Next one is definitely going to be Albania. Uh, we can ally with Yugoslavia to do that. Okay, Lithuania and Latvia. Oh, right, the Baltics. That's also something. Oh, Switzerland. Switzerland. Oh, and my nice, and my ally, Soviet Union, actually joined in. Thank you, Soviet Union. I might not remove you from the alliance list after all, since I don't need any of your cities. And I, and you were, and you proved yourself to be such a loyal ally when, you know, someone invaded me. Oh yeah, Soviet Union. I need you on my, I need you as my friend. Sorry, but you know, it's kind of what I need to do. Anyway. 5v2, first time I've met a soldier, a Swiss soldier, that actually has the healer Swiss symbol on it. 
Um, everything's still up at four. I think I might keep the power fan on four just just because. Cause I feel like that's gonna work better. Cause that this thing does this is this thing does not make sound. This thing just doesn't make sound. For some reason. Uh Luxembourg is the last one I need. Latvia got defeated by Lithuania. I cannot attack Lithuania because the Soviet Union is allied to them. Dang it! I'm gonna take the opportunity to invade Estonia right now. Uh, so. Cool, something like that. Uh, and how powerful am I compared to Estonia? Not powerful enough. Alright, let's move on in. Soviet Union is not gonna uh, join in because obviously I was the one that aggro aggro aggroed uh, Estonia. They they didn't declare war on me because they would have absolutely no reason to do so unless they were to declare war on the Soviet Union. Okay, new puppet, nice. Everything's nice. What is Norway doing? Norway is tearing the UK to shreds. Oh my God, is the UK fighting back at all? No, they aren't. All right. Iceland does not exist, it's just all Denmark, which means Denmark is actually a pretty huge nation right now. Um, this is, this is, this is too loud. Hopefully this, uh, tower fan right next to this will keep it, uh, cold. Um, so I have Paris, uh, I have Berlin, so next up is Vienna, like I mentioned earlier, but I think it wouldn't hurt to get, you know, one more puppet, so I'm just gonna quickly do that. I mean, if we didn't get the uh, Luxembourg as a puppet, we would, they would, it would just make our Weimar Empire look a little bit thicker, you know? But, oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, and once we get to Vienna, we can actually puppet Hungary as well, because it looks like they only have... Ooh, Sweden. Sweden. Chill, dude. Chill. Okay. Uh, Austria. You need to die. So... Austria is going to fall. Okay, so quick little battling spree, turn the fans up, let's go. They discovered that Hungary actually has three soldiers here, so that's not good. But anyway, I need to somehow get so, a peace treaty with Austria now. Austria is attacking everything. Soviet Union on Sweden, Estonia. Oh. Oh! This might be my chance. This might be my chance. Hold on, this is Soviet Union. Oh, Soviet Union is more powerful than me at this point. Dang it. Okay, I gotta, I gotta defend our Estonian puppet state here. The Soviet Union... It's against Sweden! Yes, okay. Mm -hmm. I like the guys with the guns. Maybe they, maybe they've produced some soldiers recently. I'm not sure, but anyway. Uh, the Soviet Union, uh... Ooh, what does the Soviet Union have that's over me? Attack and defense. Jeez, that attack. All right, we got the attack over them now. Uh, now we just need a lot of defense, huh? What happened, man? How did you get so much defense? I don't understand. I don't understand myself. But anyway, we're we're, we're still less power. What? What? How does that two defense make any difference? Okay, fine. Okay, so, peace with Austria. Peace with Austria. Okay, peace with Austria. Okay, 
And I'm gonna end the turn, and the next turn is gonna be going after Lithuania. Soviet Union might choose to go with me or against me. Oh, Hungary, 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 Hungary. That is a perfect little opportunity. I'm gonna quickly take care of, uh, of the Swedish invaders in Estonia, and uh, then I'll take care of Hungary. Because if Hungary doesn't exist, they can't attack Vienna. That's my hope, anyway. Okay, computer is still at a manageable heat level, uh, so that's good. Anyway, um, we're gonna now... Oh, Romania is taking care of them. Let's go. Uh, okay, well, you're just, you're just gonna... Yeah, you're just gonna... Okay. What? What? Jeez, Hungary. Some heavy attack you got there. I need to start upping that, because if Hungary's gonna not uh, peace out with me, that means that other countries that I invade won't peace out with me, and that's not good. Uh, yeah, everyone gets peace. Yeah, everyone gets peace. Yeah, let's go. Oh wait, look at all those soldiers waiting to join the cause. Nice. Anyone that could have me this turn? Nope. But you go. But you go. Slavia is now going after them. Uh. Anyway. Uh. I'm gonna take all the soldiers that don't have fists for weapons, because I found that that is the best thing to do. Leave the ones that um do have weapons don't, that don't have weapons to defend their homeland. Unfortunately, that's not a lot. Just <laughs> speaking of. Uh. What are other things? I can't. I. I just can't do this. I. I. I need. Uh, Dang it, this is actually turning out to be much more tedious than I thought it was going to be. Right, what is going on? Okay, you got the baseball bat. You got a shovel. And I've got my fist. And you've also got your fist. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Perfect little attack. Uh, anyway, now that that's defended, let's take your shovel, man. Okay. And does, has Persia made anything so far? Yes. Yeah, and they both have guns. Let's go. Alright. Uh, I actually need Jerusalem, so I am actually going to ally with Saudi Arabia. Um, so, uh, what do I need from them? I need Constanta, whatever, but I don't think I, I, I'm prepared for a confrontation with Great Britain. Like, they're so much more p powerful than me because of their health, the health. Oh my god, alright. We're not going after the British anytime soon. Jeez. Um, maybe Rome will be a better place to go. So maybe the French? Yeah, okay. French are doing pretty good. Uh, what about Italy? Kingdom of Italy. Oh, yep. Okay. They're gonna offer a peace with me if I do end up doing something. Okay, we're gonna end the turn. I was making sure it's border with Italy. Uh, Bulgaria and Kingdom of Romania. France is no longer. Whoa. Jeez. Weimar. Okay, Yugoslavia, you need to go away. France, you need to become my friend again. That messed up all my plans. Dang it. I think they don't want to be my ally because they're like, because I took their capital. Lithuania is gone. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Estonia, what happened? All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out here. This is not, this isn't, this isn't fine. Twelve v one. Sweden, consider yourself dead. I don't want to, I don't want to be defending Estonia, but I, at the same time, I don't want to waste my, uh, my turns on you. So, for now, you're, uh, Estonia, just keep fighting, and I will, and I will be taking care of things. Uh, Kingdom of Italy, Kingdom of Italy, it's time for you to die. Okay. My allies don't help, so 11 boosts 1. Not the greatest odds, and they get to go first, and their, and their strength is insane. However, the Dutch have some big defense going on, so... That's good. Uh, I just need to start upping my health to compete with Great Britain, don't I? Uh, okay, I just need Rome, and then uh, and then I think I'll be set for for British invasion. <sighs> Which one's a more immediate threat? Do you, why do you even share a border with me? You don't you don't share a border with me. I don't understand. 
Yugoslavia, you don't share a border with me. What the heck? Look at this. You, look at the map. You, all, you, all you share is Vienna. Why do you want Vienna so bad? Okay. Rome, you're going down. Rome needs to fall. And look at their health. They're really just standing up to me because of their huge, huge defense. Like, that's just, that's insane. Alright. Gotta get those, gotta get the health up. Oof. This is not good. Because Great Britain is just so powerful. I need so many cities from them. Look at their attack. They are bigger, they are more powerful than me in every single way. I need a lot of help if I, if I am to first of all even be able to defeat Great Britain. So, peace with you. Peace with you. And I don't think I have the turns. So, yeah, Denmark. You're, you're peacing out next. Don't anyone more declare war on me. Alright, no more enemies. That's good. I really just need to wait for my for my puppets to start making more stuff, don't I? More troops. Cause this is not this isn't right. This isn't working out anymore. I need a gun man. <sighs> I'm eyeing you, Finland. I'm really eyeing you. But you're still at war with a Estonia, Estonia, like, uh, I don't understand how hard it is, Sweden. I know, I don't understand, honestly. The UK is just getting completely torn apart by, look like, Norwegian and Dutch forces. That is great. Um, I should probably be go hire some troops. So, I'll go buy a tank, sure. Uh, buy that, okay. And what is in the military camp. I'll take, I'll take you. Wait, no, I can't afford you. Two thousand four hundred dollars, and I only have two thousand. Dang it! Uh, I need to attack some stuff to gain stars. Well, what can I attack next, just for fun? Oh, Albania, of course. Why, why didn't I think of this earlier? So Yugoslavia, you're gonna, you're, if you're gonna keep attacking me, now we're just gonna become allies. That's gonna solve all our problems. And Albania is a is a place with a lot of troops. Oh, at least that's not with me. There, I'm. St we're still allies, so that's good. Uh, we're gonna take out Albania now. Fifteen verse six. I don't got a tank as well with me, so that'll shoot all of them. So if we even get to a tank, that'll be a pretty insane thing. I've got a bug in my room. That's great. Uh, well, we'll fix that later. Boom. There we go. The tank hit three of them. It's nice. That leaves everyone else to just kind of finish them off. Perfect guy. Thank you. Okay, surrender request from Albania. Okay, what other small nations are there that I could feasibly attack without problems? I don't know. I want a challenge. I want like loads and loads of battles so I can get my stars up. Uh, Saudi Arabia and Britain are still at it. Um, the French, maybe? But the French are still my ally. I have to break an alliance. Oh yeah, Morocco's, Morocco's gone. I don't know why Morocco's gone. I, I, I actually have never looked into that. What is a challenging country? Austria, maybe? <sighs> I'm eyeing you. I'm really eyeing you. I, you know what? Hungary? Since no one's gonna be able to, since no one has taken you down yet, I'm gonna take you down. How's that? How's that sound? You know, like a nice little little fight. I'm pretty sure like you're gonna be immediately like, oh look, it's another country that has decided to tango with the great Hungarian nation. They know they definitely don't know we have seven soldiers within the walls. But no, that's not how it works, cause. Hungary is going down on this day. They are immediately probably going to cry out in despair when they see this army. Because they have all Hungary, all these Hungarian guys, right? Also, is my fan still set to... Yeah, it's still set to four. 
Uh, if I just what does this do? Okay, that's natural mode. Okay, yeah, okay. That this is the best. And then this is set to two, which is just kind of in the background. Tell me, uh, guys, if you if you think this uh fan sound is a little bit too much, then you know, look at this. Battle instantly won. Hungary, now that you've lost your great, great, great soldierland. No, okay. Well, Hungary is just just gonna die now. Okay. Well, I'm, I'll just well, I'll just leave them to die. First of all, let's check uh, all of our puppets for troops. Uh, okay, you're a fist man. No, thank you. I'm just gonna leave Estonia to it. Estonia is looking pretty good here. Um, it's besides, I'll check out Estonia every day, every every new turn, because that sounds like a good idea. Um, Turkey? No, wait, the Od the Ottoman Sultanate? Maybe Yugoslavia? Maybe. No, let's do Austria. Austria is a pretty big challenge, and then we can do France after that. Okay, Hungary is now gone, and we can increase our health by by a more of a ton. How is Great Britain doing? Great Britain is obviously still alive, and oh, their health is just going to keep increasing. I'm never going to be able to catch up at this rate. I might just have to fight it out to the death. After all, the British don't have a lot left. The British honestly just don't have a lot left. Uh, I don't want to do this right now. This is not this is not time. But if I were to ally with Hijaz, hold on. Who holds? Okay, the, the okay. Uh, if I were to ally with Hijaz, where is Hijaz? Here's Hijaz. Not not that that. No? Okay. What about Saudi Arabia? Saudi Arabia might want an alliance. Yes, they are going to say yes. Alright, and British? I'm sorry. I know you're so much more powerful than me, but, like, I know you you only have these the, the key cities left. You, you don't stand a chance. So, the British... The Jerusalem is gonna get taken today. Also, France is at war with Great Britain? I did not notice that. But I guess the French are with me. That's nice. Alright. Uh oh. I zoomed in accidentally. Uh, okay, hold on. Okay, there we go. It's back. Alright. I realized my game has it lagged oh, very hard. Okay, I'm gonna turn up the fan because we're gonna be battling for the British for a while. Alright, the Germans now hold Jerusalem. Let's go. Okay. The British have not attacked yet. The British still hold Antioch, this land, which is about to get taken by Saudi Arabia. We might actually have to intervene with Cyprus, because Cyprus is going to be a problem for our little cause here. So, yeah, let's take down Cyprus now. And then we'll take down those, the two provinces that are above Jerusalem once they actually get captured by the British. The British are actually kind of, I, ex I expected more of a challenge for, you know, a country that has 191 health, but like, really, like, we're just tearing them apart to leave, but we've got all the weapons. Like, yeah, you should, sure, sure, the British have a kitchen knife. But I don't think a kitchen knife is gonna fare well with an entire army with shovels, guns, fists, tanks. You know, it's not gonna, it's not gonna fare well. Um, but anyway. Antioch, can I even attack Antioch from here? Yes, I can. Okay. So, that might be something we want to do. So, we are probably gonna want France in here as well. Who's fighting, who's fighting Great Britain? Who, who's fighting Great Britain? If we, if, we fight, if everyone else is fighting Great Britain, I'll be happy, I'll be happy to ally with them. Uh, hi, everyone's shooting. Everyone's opening fire. Okay. Alright. That is another province down. The Germans are doing great. Uh, let's head down into this peninsula, which I never figured out. Was it with the Sinai Peninsula? I think I, I think, I think I'm thinking of something different. But, you know, the peninsula that's owned by Egypt today, that was taken by Israel in the 1965, seven, seven days war, blah, 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 blah. I don't know. I don't know the details. I don't know any of the details of history. 
History is probably my specialty, but I do not know everything about it. Alright, so, Cairo and Constant Constantinople, Alexander and that province. Alright, the, the British are attacking, the British are attacking. Alright, the British are attacking. No, no Bulgaria, no, no, no! The British, I hate the Bulgarians, now I'm gonna have to go to the war with the Bulgarians. Take, to take Cons Constantinople. Dang it! We gotta take care of their African lands, otherwise we're never gonna win. Cyprus is just becoming more and more of a problem every day. Hold on, they need a coast to access uh, Cyprus, which means if I just take this, uh, never mind. If I just take this province and the French take that, that'll be good. Mm, is anyone else? Okay. You know what? The British should just surrender at this point. They're outnumbered. They've got like no troops left. Their their general is just dying over and over here. Is he actually dying or is he surrendering each time? I'm not sure. Yeah, he he surrendered that time. Which means I'll come back for another day. Yay! Okay, I have to take this province, and the French can take that, which will remove their avenue back to uh. Back to Cyprus. That's the end goal anyway, because if they can't attack Cyprus, then they'll be limited to their provinces down in Egypt, which will eventually get taken out. That's the plan anyway. Uh, I'm gonna turn this fan down, because I'm not sure if you can hear anything I'm saying here. Oh, well, oh yeah, I also got 21 stars, so that's great. Uh, we're gonna end turn. And we're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna have to deal with this, am I? Alright, they're attacking. They're, they're attacking this again? What do you mean they can attack this? Oh, they must be able to attack from here, right? Does that mean... If I... <sighs> Dang it, I thought I would be able to go around Cairo entirely, but I guess not. Who else is... Oh, Saudi Arabia is joining? I see, that's why. That's why. Saudi Arabia is actually joining, it's not just France. I never even noticed the Saudi Arabian ball in here. Remember, this is the old Saudi Arabian flag with like a little white strip down here that you actually can't see, and then the little the little sword or is it a sword or a katana? I'm just gonna call it blade. The blade underneath is a little different. It's orientated in, in the in the other direction, and it looks different than modern day. All right, let's join the battle for this peninsula that the British want back so much. Okay, let's go. Boom. 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 Alright. We're getting actually very close to finishing. But anyway, uh, down into Cairo we go. Uh, I actually don't think you guys can actually hear the speaker, because I have my speaker currently off. I figured, uh, I, my, my ears had, had to take a break, but I didn't, I, I didn't think that would affect you guys. Well, I guess you're watching this with no music on and no sound effects, that's kind of disappointing. Alright, back to battle mode. Fans gonna be on, I probably, I'll be talking less and less. Okay. Uh, until we finish fighting. have attacked Cairo. Wait, hold on. How are they still attacking Nikosia? Oh, I see. Czechoslovakia is doing stuff now. Uh, maybe they get intimidated by this? Maybe? Alright, fine. Maybe they'll get intimidated by this. Full health. Maybe they'll get intimidated by that and leave me alone. Okay, please. Now, leave me alone. Thank you. Alright, so, one, one turn down. So, how many more provinces does the British have? 
they've, they've, they've got, they've got no provinces left. All right, that means I don't even have to defend my territories because take down these two, we're done. This is British. Nope, that's Greek. Uh, yeah. So I don't even have to defend these territories. I don't think anyway. If I, if I did have to, then I, that, that, that's gonna set us back a lot because they have to reclaim those lands. But anyway. Is the general actually dying or is he surrendering? Last time I checked, he was surrendering. He, he surrendered again. But I bet you that on this last battle, he's gonna die. Because obviously, the British die with him, maybe? Maybe that's the plan? So, let's see. Let's just see. Fan, my stand fan is going to get turned off. Okay, he still surrendered. Maybe the British just always surrender. Okay, Great Britain is now dead, which means only one more city to complete this. Constantinople, Greece, Greece, Greece. What do you want from me? You want Alexandria? Well, um, so Greece, don't you think it would, it would be nice if we, like, became friends? Like, maybe that'd be cool? Like, I don't know, but, like, I don't know about you, but I have, do I have, oh, I still have Yugoslavia as a friend. Right. Uh, I'm gonna end the turn. And hopefully no one else declares war on me, because that would really thwart my plans. Thank you, thank you, thank you, nobody attacking me, because I just need Constantinople, don't mind me. Ah, Romania, Romania. Trying to be a good friend, I see. Well, you just, you just check it out, I don't know. <sighs> okay. That, the Romania could have made things a lot harder for me. 17 versus 6. That's nice. Wh which one of my allies joined me? Which one of my allies was nice enough to join me? Which one? Soviet Union? Yep, Soviet Union. I don't know why the Soviet Union is actually is. I don't know if the, why the Soviet Union is at war with Bulgaria, but whatever. How long have I been recording? I really hope I can finish this off soon. I've been trying to speed this video up as much as possible. I actually tried this challenge yesterday, tried filming it, but it took so so long that my computer overheated, shut down. I lost all the footage. Very sad. I'm hoping to just take Constantinople and go. If I can't do that, then I'll come back for that territory. It turns out it's just the Soviet Union. Okay. I guess the Soviet Union doesn't doesn't like. Okay. Whatever. I don't know why the Bulgarians hired so many troops. I'm gonna turn this fan off, the computer's getting a little bit too hot for me to, and it's starting to worry me, so, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna turn that down. Okay, Constantinople, why is it called Con, how do you pronounce it, it's Constantinople, Constantinople. Constanti, yeah, let's, let's pronounce it Constanti. And I think this should be the last city. I have I survived until 1926 yet? I don't know if it's even 1926 yet. I haven't been paying attention to the date. It is. Oh, I won. Okay. I've unlocked Austria legendary. That's nice. Wait. Yes, a new country in my playground. Yes, let's add him to the collection of laughing people. Now, uh, I just trapped everybody in barbed wire and forced them to laugh for all of eternity. Also, I realize I have an open page here, so I'm just being an idiot, am I? Uh, laugh elixir. Give that to you. And I don't know what's going on with the Ottoman Empire. Why are you like free over here? Can you stay in your place? Thank you. Uh, so yeah. Um, that is that 
campaign complete? Did the glitch reset itself? Nope. Um, I still have every single country ball, including the Rebels ball, for some reason. I went too far. Yeah, for, for some reason. Just, you know, for some reason. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we're gonna end this playthrough off. Whole playthrough. I'm gonna turn this down just to make this a little bit better. Um, uh, turn everything off. I'm gonna end this playthrough off right here. Hope you enjoyed this playthrough of 1922 Campaign as the Weimar Republic. And goodbye.